Disgusting living conditions, all because of an infestation at one Independence apartment building. Our drywall didn't have holes before, but they're actually chewing it. Mm. Mice creating a nightmare for one woman, she says, and only on 41 Action News, reporter Sarah Plake takes us inside the problem and then takes the renter's concerns right to the landlord. She said this problem has been going on for months, and when you open the oven, all you get is an unappetizing serving of mouse poop. I don't use those two because usually in the morning when I wake up, there's mouse poop covering the entire thing. Lisa lives at the you Hudson Apartments it. in Independence, uh -huh. and for months, she says her family has been dealing with some unwanted guests. Our drywall didn't have holes before, but they're actually chewing it. She says mice find their way in through holes around the apartment and live in the stove, tearing out the insulation from her walls to make a home. And here in her kid's bedroom closet, we see a mouse peeking his head out of a hole she tried to cover. I'm just really frustrated because if I was a landlord, I wouldn't want somebody living like that. Like, that could make a kid sick. Lisa says she's contacted the apartment office nearly a dozen times, and so far they've put poison traps in the unit. We tried to talk with management, but an employee said the property manager was not there, but someone would call us back. We never got a call back. Lisa says as soon as our crew left, management promised to fix the issue this week. When tenants have these issues, they need to fill out a complaint form with the city. If we can find evidence that it has spread to multiple units throughout that building, then the landlord does become responsible for that issue. The city of Independence says complaints are usually settled with a landlord fixing the issue. Lisa hopes that's the case, especially after her daughter brought her a dead mouse. I think this is the third time she's brought me a mouse. I know she's trying to help, but shouldn't have to happen. Sarah Plake, 41 Action News.